Welcome to the head-to-head -head competition between the industry-leading Velo Air Mover and the new Phoenix Air Max. From point of tested specifications, the Velo blows away the competition from Phoenix. However, specifications only say so much. The arena for today's event is a 12 foot by 14 foot even cut pile carpet. Misted by a mobile gantry system to ensure precise control over the wetting application across the entire surface during multiple testing cycles. Let's see what we get from the Champion Velo and its patent pending outlet. It delivers air evenly across the outlet surface, more so than any other air mover on the market. From a thermal imaging camera view, we should be able to see the evaporation footprint created by the air mover. Well, the air mover running, we can see the dark blue rapid evaporation evenly distributed out of the front of the air mover. And the dark red areas where area is beginning to dry immediately in front of the air mover. That's, that's pretty good velocity evenly distributed across that entire surface out in front of the air mover. Nice, even distribution. Great drying rate from the Velo. So judges are comparing information, temperature, humidity, making sure it's a fair playing arena. And here comes the crew to prep the arena for the next contender with another even coat of moisture from the gantry system. From the red corner, we have the Phoenix Air Max. Taking a look at the thermal images, we have some evaporation out in the arena. However, it's thrown off to the left-hand side. It looks like we're losing some airflow on that left-hand side. We've got some good drying right in front of the air mover, but doesn't seem to be working its way down the arena quite like it did with the Champion Velo. Looks like the contender is gonna fall a bit short in this round. What an exciting performance in the arena today in this head-to-head -head competition. Let's do some instant replay and take a look at some of the critical stages in the process. On the left-hand side, we see the Champion Velo with dark blue high evaporation centered on the air mover out across the field of the arena. On the right-hand side, we see the competitor, the Air Max, throwing air off to the left-hand side and not nearly as much evaporation out in the field. Let's freeze frame five minutes into the competition. On the left-hand side, we see the Champion Velo has dried all the way out into the surface of the arena halfway down the screen, whereas the Air Max has made it about a third of the way. Looks like the Velo Air Mover from Dry Ease Products remains the champion. Thank you for joining us today for this head-to-head -head competition.